A man falls off a boat and ends up on an island. After a lot of walking he comes across a shop that specializes in brains. Artists' brains $9 per ounce. Philosophers' brains $12 per ounce. Scientists' brains $15 per ounce. Republicans' brains $19 per ounce. Democrats' brains $2,000 per ounce. After the man reads the prices, he says, Wow those Democrat brains must be popular. The shop owner says, Are you kidding? Do you know how many Democrats you have to kill to get one ounce of brains? What happens when you cross a pig with a Democrat? Nothing, there are some things that a pig just won't do. Why should Democrats be buried alive 100 feet down? Because deep down, they really are good people. What is the difference between a Democrat and a catfish? One is an ugly, scum-sucking, bottom feeder, and the other is a fish. What is the difference between a Democrat and a trampoline? You take off your shoes before you jump on a trampoline. What is the difference between a Democrat on a motorcycle and a vacuum? The vacuum has the dirt bag on the inside. What is the difference between a Democrat and a prostitute? The prostitute gives value for the money she takes. What is the difference between a Democrat and a bucket of crap? The bucket. What is black, and brown, and looks good on a Democrat? A Doberman. What is the definition of a shame, when a busload of Democrats goes off a cliff? What is the definition of a, crying, shame, when there was an empty seat? When Albert Einstein died, he met three people in the line outside the pearly gates. To pass the time, he asked what their IQs were. The first replied 190. Wonderful! exclaimed Einstein. We can discuss the contribution made by Ernest Rutherford to atomic physics, and my theory of general relativity. The second answered 150. Good! said Einstein. I look forward to discussing the role of Gingrich's contract with American legislation in moving us into the 21st century. The third person mumbled 50. Einstein paused, and then asked. What was it like being vice president, Mr. Gore? How many Republicans does it take to raise your taxes? Trick question, the Democrats do that. What is the difference between a liberal and a puppy? A puppy stops whining after it grows up. What is the difference between a smart Democrat and Bigfoot? Bigfoot has actually been spotted. What do you get when you cross a bad politician with a bad lawyer? Chelsea Clinton. How many Democrats does it take to screw in a light bulb? Just one, but it really ends up getting screwed. Santa Claus, the Tooth Fairy, a wise old Democrat, and a drunk are walking down a street when they spot a $100 bill in the middle of the road. Who do you think got it? The drunk obviously. The other three are mythological creatures. The symbol of each party greatly represents the party it stands for. The elephant is strong and intelligent like the Republicans. For the Democrats, well, the ass should speak for itself. I'm a devout Christian. Oh yeah? Well, I'm a devout Christian who knows how to hunt. Talk about bitter people, clinging to God and guns. What do you call a Democrat in jail? Justice. Liberals are like seagulls, all they do is squawk, eat crap, and are protected by the government. How can you tell when Bill Clinton is lying? When his lips are moving? What is the difference between an elderly couple and a couple of Democrats? The elderly couple will eventually stop bickering. I hate you. Evolve. If you agree with Al Gore, should you really be driving right now? Republicans want to fight them there. Democrats want to fight them here. Confuse a liberal, use logic and facts. Liberalism is a disease. Common sense is the cure. The only difference between Obama and Osama is BS. How will Democrats stand up to terrorists when they can't even face Fox News? My teacher were a Democrat. Seven Pillars of Liberalism. 
Just tonight. Always blame America. Clinton is good. Perjury is very bad. Kill innocent babies, not convicted murderers. Al-Qaeda has rights. Christians don't. Support our troops by rooting against them. Socialism, there is no substitute. If Hillary Clinton is the answer, it must have been a stupid question. Too bad cars don't run on stupidity. I'm a right-wing, anti-illegal, pro-life, gun-owning, straight, white, college-educated, politically informed, conservative, Christian male. Liberals state me. Move to Canada like you promised. Vote Democrat, it's easier than working. The audacity of bullshit. If it's okay to call Bush Hitler, then I say it's okay to call Obama Muslim. Legacy. Reagan brought down communism, Clinton brought down his pants. Barack Hussein Obama for president, because you can fool some of the people all of the time. Experience. U.S. Senator for three years, check. That's about it. Got experience? No. Don't act stupid. We have Democrats for that. Yes, we can destroy America. McCain 2008. Proven leadership, so that we don't have to hope. Democratic National Committee. Assisting Al-Qaeda since. September 11th, 2001. Al Gore, the Democrats' pet rock. Aborted babies go to FN, but their parents go to L. Dear Al, Quita, give us Osama, or we'll send you Hillary. Saluting the flag, so easy, a liberal can do it. Don't be a jackass, vote Republican in 08. How to be a Democrat. Step 1, open mouth. Step 2, say something dumb. Step 3, backtrack. Step 4, deny you said it. Step 5, blame the Republicans. Step 6, go to step 1. Democratic National Committee. Like an ass, only more full of shit. I cling to my religion because the liberals want to abolish it. I have a dream. 10 out of 10 idiots support Obama. Don't worry little Democrat. One day, you'll grow up to be a Republican like me. After watching this, I hope you go and take a damn oh crap. If you have any problems with any of these jokes slash pictures, simply leave the number of the picture in your comment and I will address your concern as best as I can. God bless, the grand old party. Thanks for watching.